What's going on guys? Today I've got five brand new Cydia tweaks. These were all released in uh, just early August um, and some were released I think in late July like call bar. But the first one I've got for you guys today is called Delete Word. Delete Word is completely free from the Big Boss repo. You can find it in some other repos as well but may as well just download it from the Big Boss repo. Um, it's an awesome tweak. Really simple. Pretty much what it'll allow you to do. Let me show you here. Just go to a note. It'll pretty much just allow you to delete whole words at a time so rather than just going through and deleting one letter at a time or holding it until you get to the point where you can delete you know kind of more by two words and then three words and then it kind of goes on from there um, if you want to just neatly uh, delete one single word at a time let me zoom in here you just hold the shift button or you can use the um, symbols button or if you're in the symbols mode you can use the numbers button as well um, and you just hold this and press the backspace button and it deletes a whole word so this is just a pre-made note as you can see here so again just hold and you can delete several at a time and uh, it's much better than just holding um, the backspace button to delete several words because sometimes you go way too far and you kind of delete some words that you don't want to delete so uh, check this one out again it's from the big boss repo absolutely free from the developer iSAM it's called delete word all right, so the next one I've got for you guys today is called Quick MP3. Now, what Quick MP3 allows you to do is basically just you can set it using Activator, um, using several different activation methods, whatever you want. And uh, right now, I've got mine set to just pressing the up volume button and then the down volume button. And what that'll allow you to do is while you're in an application, you can search for pretty much any MP3 you want. So I'm just going to do a quick search for Billy Jean. Uh, it's kind of hard to type through the camera. I'll just look at the iPhone here. There we go. So Billie Jean, I searched Billie Jean, Michael Jackson. Tons of different tracks come up. Uh, let's do this one. Why not? So I just selected that one there. You saw it disappear from the list. And then you can see at the very bottom of your screen right over here, it's got the download status. So right now it's at 13%, 14% and counting. So I'll just show you when it's fully downloaded. I'll show you where that goes and how you can access that song because it does not download directly to your iTunes. I know it's unfortunate, but realistically they've kind of made it very difficult to download anything directly to iTunes or directly to your iPod application. But anyways, I'm at 92% here and wow, that was really fast. So 100% really fast download. And at this point you might be thinking, okay, so where did it go? What you want to do is you want to go to iFile. All right, so once you've got your iFile open, just go to, well, this is from the root folder. So I'll show you how to get there from the root. Just go to your root folder, then go to var and scroll down to you get to mobile and then library and then you want to scroll to get to downloads and there she is Michael Jackson that'd be the Billie Jean radio remix so 7.5 megabytes so that is the file and it was just added right now at uh, the 8th of August 9:54 p.m. so uh, yeah that's it right there awesome tweet guys you can just play this directly through the audio player And it sounds like it's some kind of remix, definitely not the original Billie Jean. But um, I already have downloaded the original Billie Jean. There's tons of tracks on here, lots available. So definitely check this one out from the Cydia store. Again, this one is called Quick MP3. All right, so the next tweak I've got for you guys is called Badge Clear. This one comes from the Big Boss repo for 99 cents, um, but it can be found from other repos for free. Not necessarily condoning it, but just letting you know. It can be found from other repos for free. Now, um, once you install this one, it's super simple. All you have to do is go into wiggle mode and just tap on the badge. Um, so, and then you can just clear the badge. So let's do that, click yes and it clears the badge. So um, this can be useful for a lot of people that are kind of tired of seeing those badges. Like, I know that I have five updates, but I really don't want to update those tweaks from Cydia. So what I'm gonna do is just clear that badge. Yes, there we go. So no more annoying badges telling me to do something that I don't want to do. All right, so the next tweak I've got for you guys is called Call Bar. This is a really nice tweak, which kind of explains the price here, $3.99 from the Big Boss repo. And again, you can find this tweak from other repos for free, um, just letting you know. So let's make a call. I'll show you what this guy does. Um, so let me first go into my settings and disable Call Bar. Sorry for that glare, that one that one okay here we go all right so let's go down to call bar here and let's first disable it okay it's disabled so I'll make a call to myself not showing you my phone number
Okay, so now we're making a call. And this is just how it regularly, what we're used to here. We get this whole pop-up. It completely interrupts everything that we're doing. Um, just to say that I'm getting a call. Decline. Yes, I'm too cheap. I have no caller ID. Um, so, but in, with call bar enabled here. Okay, so now we have it enabled. And let's say we're just browsing YouTube or something cool like that. Um, then when you receive a call. So let's say I'm watching a YouTube page, video. Just tap that. And I receive a call, which is going to come anytime now. There you go. You've got the call bar actually at the top of the screen. So it doesn't interrupt anything you're doing. You can still do whatever you want to do. If I want to play the video, I can play the video, pause, whatever I want to do. Um, and I can choose to answer or decline. So let's answer the call and talk to myself. What's going on, myself? How are you doing? I'll put this on speakerphone. Maybe if it's on speakerphone. Whoa. Okay, bad idea. I'm gonna hang up now. Yeah. Anyhow, you get the point. So, really cool app from uh, Big Boss Repo for $3.99. Again, you can find it in other repos for free. Check it out. It's called Callbar. Okay, so the last week I've got for you guys today is called Email Safari Screenshot, and I'll show you what it does here. Let's just go into Safari. Um, this is my brand new website. I just launched it this week. I can show you a little bit more. I'll probably make a separate video, but it's called Jailbreak City. You can just go to jailbreakcity.com. Um, a whole bunch of updates and whatnot on Cydia, tweaks and news and all that kind of stuff. You can subscribe to my different social networks and whatnot. But anyhow, this tweak, email Safari screenshot, what it'll allow you to do is when you click that share page at the bottom, so let's say you wanted to email this page and share it with some friends or whatever, um, you've got a couple options, add bookmark, add to home screen, and now when you click the mail link to this page, what it will do is in your mail application, it will actually uh, preload a screenshot directly on there with the link to the page. So regularly, it would just give you a link to the page. You can send it to whoever you want to send it to. But now, with this application, it'll actually give a screenshot. So a uh, really cool tweak if you're into sharing things with uh, different people, if you're on social networks, or even if you're not and you just want to share a specific website with one of your friends, anything like that, then check this out. It's uh, free from the Big Boss Repo email Safari screenshot. All right, well, that's all I've got for you guys today. Make sure to check out the website, jailbreakcity.com. It is still definitely under construction. I'm still even, um, you know, messing around with the color scheme and everything. But I've got lots of stuff on here, lots of good content as far as news and things. I've got top five um, city of tweaks and themes, and I'm always updating it based on my videos and my other works and whatnot. Um, I've even got socialization -ness at the side over here. You can add me on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube. I've got polls, keepers, and dumpers, so if you kind of have liked some tweaks and themes that I've reviewed, sorry this whole camera thing is completely off-centered and tilted and whatnot, but um, whatever. Uh, so I've got keepers and dumpers, so like let's say you've downloaded a theme or tweak that I like, you can vote to say if you like it or don't like it so like I swipe perhaps um, I did a video on that it looked cool at the time but I would say it's a dumper two votes 25% say keeper and six votes say dumper and I agree um, so yeah lots of things going on on the website um, so definitely check back again it is kind of in not even beta really it's just starting to develop I just pretty much started this whole website on Monday um, did the graphics and everything myself from scratch um, and these graphics I got from iconshop.com thank you very much for those social media graphics anyhow I'm not gonna dwell on this too long I'll make a separate video for this alone thanks for watching guys and I'll see you next time peace